Let's get to Jim and stop trading. You know, I'm always concerned about Taiwan and what could happen with China. The president, the new president, President Lack, has been inconsistent. He was anti-China at one point, said that Taiwan should have to pay its own. But there's an interesting split between Taiwan Semi and NVIDIA. They always trade together. But maybe, maybe Taiwan Semi, uh, they, they put something on. If they put a tariff on, it's bad for NVIDIA. I would come back and say NVIDIA is a crown jewel, and the president is not going to go against a crown jewel, and that in the end, the Taiwan Semi relationship will be preserved, and you should not sell NVIDIA on any of this, because I think the president still celebrates jewels that don't take money. Remember, they're not a chip ben chips act vendor for sure. Right. Also, given Elon Musk, one of the most powerful people in government he'll be, uh, and what he has said and how he relies so much on NVIDIA. Uh, they have sometimes, they're frenemies because obviously uh, I think that Elon would like to be independent, but he always says the same thing, which is, boy, they make good chips. So I think that NVIDIA is not a loser, but a winner in this situation. All right, so overall, Jim? Look, uh, overall, today? overall, I think you have to follow that tomorrow's the bond market's in control. We have an, a couple of auctions going on that are not good. Uh, so remember uh, that there are two things you need to remember. When interest rates go up, it hurts the Procter and Gambles, and when we have trade wars, it hurts the Procter and Gambles. So I wouldn't buy Procter yet. <laughs> what? What? Nothing. I see. What's the matter? It's getting hit on both. Yeah. How about him, huh? Luau loves. Luau <laughs> loves. Luau loves Wells Fargo. <laughs> uh, Charlie, Regions Financial. Yeah, and Charlie Sharp is the winner because I think the asset cap goes away, and I happen to think. And David, you know, I like Charlie more than Jamie. And I said that because then I'm going to get the phone call from J.P. Morgan saying, "Why'd you say that?" And I just say it's gratuitous. This is, and I haven't even praised Anna Boutin yet. Because it's true. You do like Charlie more than Jamie. No, it has nothing to do with. It. David, it's business, not personal. I'm not like the president. president. Jim, our thanks. Business. Viewers, thank you for oh, the work you've done Carl, the last 24 done, hours. I mean, I watched every L. I come home. My wife is watching another channel. I grabbed the clicker, man. Come on. I said, I want to see how long this guy lasts. This guy's going for the, for the record. <laughs>